this girl Christine, I mean, she gives Brad one tour of the business school. She's a sophomore, we're a freshman, so of course she tries to go for experience. But I mean, she's she's just this cute little number. She just I don't I don't see anything special to her, but yet she has Brad's heart. That's all he can talk about. Oh, Christine, I love you so much. I just want to marry you and have kids with you and settle down in a little in a little high country home. Yeah, she's late. What if she doesn't come? should have dressed up. Hey guys, thanks for letting me join your group. Uh, yeah, no problem. Sorry about being all dressed up. I'm going to see a speaker after this and I wouldn't have time to change otherwise. Well, let's get started. Hey, okay, sounds good. What are you guys doing now? You want to come to the speaker series with me? Um, I actually had a, a lot of work to do. I know Brad's free though. Yeah? Uh, yeah, I guess. I'm a little underdressed though. Hey, don't worry about it. It'll be fun. All right, you guys have a good time. Man, that speaker was great. Learned a lot about networking and how to be professional in the business world. And I mean, the best part is I think I got another date with Christine. Chua! To be more socially responsible, I propose that they get hot chicks and cute women as the greeters instead of the old wrinkly men. Because who wants to shake the hand of an old wrinkly man instead of a cute woman? Hold on. Yo. Drew. What's going on? Dude, I completely bombed that test. The intro test? Yeah, man. I have no idea what to do. I am so screwed. Well, you should go in and talk to your TA. Chances are she has office hours. Office hours? Yeah, man. Office hours is exactly what that type of situation is for. Really? Yeah, just look at your syllabus and it, she's probably somewhere in the business school. All right, thanks, man. I owe you big. Yeah, I, I know you owe me big. This is just one of many. Um, okay. Hello? Hi. Hi. Um, you want to see me? I would like to, yeah. You know what, I'm a little bit busy right now. Could you wait a few minutes? Sure. Okay, yeah. all right. Thanks. Hi. Can I help you? Hi. Uh, yeah, I would like to talk to you about a test I just took in business. Oh, okay, come on, yeah. sit down. A little busy? Oh yeah, I, it's been a really busy day. I'm really sorry. I just had you know one student after the next, and I'm trying to work on class for tomorrow. And you know, you know, oh. you know, life of a 
an instructor. Okay. So, who are you? Well, I'm a freshman. My name is Brad, and I took my first business test, and I didn't do so hot. So you failed it, and um, why was that? Do you think? I mean, I I put I put a couple hours in to studying. Tell me about coming to class, and you kind of recognize me. I mean, I went to class quite a bit. Um, I probably made like 70% of class. 70% of class. What yeah. were you doing the other time? It's bold. I mean, there's always stuff to do. So, like, what are you doing? Here's the deal. You got to go to class. You got to go to class. Um, here's the key about, about what we ask of you. We don't want you to memorize a bunch of things you're going to forget two weeks later. We want you to learn and begin to understand and apply. It's a much higher form of learning, and it's something that, you know, you can't just you can't just study by memorizing. That's not learning. That's just repeating. Right? We want you to apply things. So you're going to have to begin to think that way in your classes. And then you'll be really successful. Study all the way along, do the readings in a timely fashion, and come to see me with your exam. Come to see me with your exam. We'll look at it, what you did wrong. We'll talk about what the right answers are. And you'll do much better the next time. It is very, very common for people to do poorly on that first exam because for exactly the reasons you said. So you can do this, and you will do this. Just hang in there, and um, let's spend as much time together as possible to get you uh, on the right path. Okay? All right. All right. It's, well, been, it's been a pleasure. Thanks a bunch, Donna. Okay. It's nice well, to meet now. you. You too. Donna seemed kind of interesting, <laughs> to say the least at first, but I mean, she had some really good advice. But uh, yeah, I look forward to bringing my test to her. Hopefully she can help me out with that. And uh, yeah, this is not high school anymore. I actually have to do work in college. I don't know what's up, but yeah. I felt something this morning so stared at the sea. I learned a lot these past few weeks. I feel a lot more comfortable and at home now that I've got to know more people in the business school. I followed up with Donna and got an A on my next intro test. I tried out for Lee's Council and got in thanks to all the help from Mary Banks. I'm lucky my roommate knew a lot, but I've learned I can't keep relying on him for everything I need. I'm looking forward to the rest of my time at the University of Colorado and the Lee School of Business. If there's one thing I've learned, is that all the resources are here to help you be successful, you just have to use them.